Happy New Year's Eve, you guys. Oh my goodness, 2016 is all the most over. If I can just hold out for the next nine hours, it'll be gone. Um, so I'm just sitting at my desk right now. I'm about to upload a video for tonight. And um, I haven't really eaten since this morning, so I'll probably fix something for lunch. And I don't have many plans tonight. I actually don't know what I'm going to do. We have watch night service later on tonight. But that's quite a bit later on. We don't have to be to church until 11 o'clock. So, um, I just wanted to come on and say, hey, if I have enough footage, then I will upload this for you guys. And not, I'll just put this in another vlog. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, it's about six o'clock now and I'm getting ready to make supper. Um, I was debating on whether I wanted to go ahead and cook now because we have church later on tonight, but church doesn't start until 11 and I don't want us to eat and then be hungry during church. So it's six-ish, I'm not absolutely sure what time it is, but I thought I would go ahead and just start making supper and I'm gonna make some barbecue chicken, baked beans, I'm going to do some greens on the stove. I'm just going to saute them. And then for some odd reason, I know y'all can see behind me, I have Jiffy Mix. I don't really remember buying Jiffy Mix, and it's something that I usually don't buy. <laughs> but for some reason, I have Jiffy Mix, so I'm going to go ahead and make the Jiffy Mix to go with the greens. And I think that's what I'm going to end up making for supper tonight. I may wait a little while before I start cooking, though. I think if I cook now, I think it will be hungry during church and I don't want to be hungry so I'm just gonna wait it's a little after six so I'm gonna wait until about seven to start making supper in the meantime I'm just sitting in my office now which is a mess and I'm trying to plan out some videos for January so that's basically what I'm doing I try to um I'm trying to go ahead and plan some things out so I don't become completely blindsided with uploading to two channels which so far has been really good I'm liking the separation and I'm lacking that everybody is <laughs> happy so far so my vlog stuff is on my vlog stuff and that's on a Lawson's life and everybody's happy with that and then Teresa Lawson I'm able to share things that are you know more sit down ish and more planned out and put together so that's cool too and right now I'm basically just planning out things for Teresa Lawson because like I said this channel doesn't take a lot of planning I just share with you guys whatever I'm doing so you know you'll get a vlog every Sunday that's the plan I'm hoping that every Sunday I'll be able to upload some vlog for you guys and then on Teresa Lawson uh, my goal is to have a video up every Wednesday and Saturday so that's what I'm planning now um, I was just looking at my calendar, my planner actually, and Steven got me a new planner for the new year. And I was just looking to see how many videos I needed to come up with with ideas. And I'm going to need eight ideas. And so far I have about 10 video ideas for that channel. So what I like to do is I'm just writing down all the video ideas and then I'm going to go through and make a list of everything I need for that video and what topics I want to talk about in that video and that way when I go to film it it doesn't take a lot of time because I have everything you know kind of situated because taking the guesswork out of filming is really important for me right now I just want to make sure that everything has you know a system I gotta be more systematic so that's all I'm trying to do now so since I have about 45 minutes to kill I'm gonna go ahead and maybe plan a little bit in my planner I haven't put up any stickers or anything in my planner and I want to go ahead and do that and then I'm going to just map out more of these videos Here's the planner Steven got me for Christmas and I'm about to plan in it for the very first time. So all of you know that this is a happy planner and it just says make every day count. I haven't done anything in this yet. So this was an 18 month planner and um, I just pulled the other months out of this. So it's starting with January 2017. 
and I've just written in the bills that I need to take care of for January over to the side and now I'm going to plan in here and he also got me some booklets of stickers so I got this one and I have this one with the inspirational quotes I have another one with the inspirational quotes and then I have a um, gold foiled one of the regular one that I showed you guys first so to plan I'm gonna use this gold foiled one and I think I'm gonna use one of the inspirational quote packets and then I'm also probably gonna use some of the other stickers that I showed you guys a little while ago that I got from Dollar Tree I'm not absolutely sure what I'm gonna do in the planner right now um, and I have these that I also got from the Dollar Tree and I have this set that I picked up from Hobby Lobby for a dollar and you can see why it's a dollar it's pretty old now but I'm just going to use these you know because they don't have the date on them so I'm just gonna go ahead and start planning and I'll show you guys what I come up with all right here is what I came up with this is what I have so far sometimes I like to go back and add other stickers as time goes by but basically I like to keep a lot of space so that I can go back in and write things out but all of the stickers that I used are to motivate me to do what I need to do to make things happen and I have a lot of things that I would like to see come into fruition not just for this year but you know all together so I have things that motivate me to work hard and you know stay focused imagine believe and then of course happy new year and then this one down here says hustle you know that's another you know work hard make things happen type of thing got a couple of birthdays this month on the 25th is my sister and actually on the first is my nephew so yeah this is what i have so far and then these say movie but um those are the days that i have kind of mapped out to edit my videos or film and edit so that's why I have those hopefully it will remind me to stay on track with that and I like the color scheme like that um, pale blue and gold and black so this is what I'm working with for the month of January I just really want to start this year off strong and get things accomplished done with dinner got the baked beans got the barbecue chicken we also have some collard greens that I cooked down in smoked sausage and then got cornbread so this is our New Year's Eve dinner 
and we are about to eat up. Wait, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Would you look at me like you're going to be enjoying my dancing? Happy New Year, you guys. I guess that's the 2017 dance. No, it's not. What is that, babe? What are you doing? What's going on here? Hmm? Hmm? I don't know what kind of dance that is. <laughs> I just wanted to say goodnight. We, uh... You the one got your face all in my hair? So fluffy. <laughs> We just got here from church. It's pretty late. Babe, maybe he's tired. <laughs> church was good. We had a good service. And um, we about to call it a night. Go to bed because we got to be right back at church in, I don't know, eight, nine hours, something like that. <laughs> wait, wait, what was that? Did you just walk off in defeat? Yeah. Why? We got too much stuff going on. We got too much stuff going on? We got church. So today's Sunday. It's, it's a normal Sunday. Oh, yeah, today's Sunday. Normal Sunday. But anyway, um, Happy New Year. It is officially January 1st, 2017. We made it. Hey, baby. That's what we should have seen tonight. We made it. 2017. Y'all, 2016 was a trying year. It was a trying year. Almost took us out, but we made it. Um, thank God that we made it. So, anyway, we about to go to bed. So, reality. Reality? 2017. Ain't nothing changed. A lot is gonna change, though. Just say goodnight and be happy. Later. Good night. <laughs>